Hello there. In this video, we'll be looking at Longshot's custom template feature. Now, as you know, there are a lot of standalone templates available. As you can see, when you click over here, you can look at all the standalone templates that are available to you. Now, all these templates serve a very specific purpose. Now, if you wish to generate a template which is based on your own needs, you want to customize it, you can use the custom template for that thing. So uh, you can click over here or you can click over here, the custom template feature. And uh, you can also find all your safe uh, templates inside this feature. So if I open up a custom template, this is where the magic happens. And uh, in this video, we'll be looking at how you can create a custom template and get amazing results using the custom template feature. So keep watching. Okay, so as you can see, I've put in the custom blog conclusion as the template name. So this is the name of the template, which will be saved and I'm putting in the description, uh, which is basically it's all about writing the blog conclusion using the headline and the selected outline. So uh, this is important if you want to save your template for future. So you put in a name and a description. And uh, what I'll do is I'll also add a prompt or a description of what I want the AI to do. So write a blog conclusion. It's exactly like kind of same to the description. So write a blog conclusion using the headline and selected outlines. Okay. Now creating the prompt formula. This is something which uh, which is important for AI to understand. So uh, headline, which is the first uh, context, basically headline, uh, percentage headline, and then closing with the percentage sign. Okay, yeah. So you can see that the test prompt appears similarly for outline following the same steps and yeah, close it. And uh, yeah, it has appeared below as well. So next is the uh, writing the conclusion. So yeah, write the conclusion. <clears throat> yeah, using the following or selected outlines. So you'll find the selected outline section as well. So what we'll do is uh, let me go down. Yeah. So first save the prompt, maybe in future, if you wish to use the prompt again. So what you can do is uh, let's open the templates. Yeah. Okay. Blog templates first. Uh, yeah. Let's open the blog. Uh, here's the custom uh, conclusion generator. So you can see we have a blog over here. Uh, let me copy paste the H1, the title, which is headline, which is how to get financially ready to buy a house. And then the outline, which is check your credit score. Uh, it can be anything, right? It can be your H2, your H3, whatever things like you want to add in your uh, conclusion. So just copying and pasting, uh, give them a number one, two, three. And uh, I think, I believe there are six in total. Uh, let me copy paste each of these subheadings yeah number four and okay okay there are seven actually there's one left so get a home inspection is the last one after this one okay let me copy that and let's paste it So yeah, now, now that you have all your outlines ready, you can uh, totally select which outlines you want the AI to generate a conclusion about. So uh, let's say one, the first outline, let's add, let's include the first point, the fourth point and uh, the sixth point. So if we look at only these three um, outlines, your subheadings, so AI will try to create a conclusion based on these three only. So uh, let's see what the AI comes up with. And uh, here we go. So Okay, the first thing was check your credit score and that's been mentioned over here. And the fourth one was about the mortgage mortgage yeah, mortgage process. Uh, okay, it's mentioned and the final one was about six point negotiate the purchase price, which you can find over here. Okay, now looking at the next use case, uh, let me open up a new tab. Let me just, okay. So uh, yeah, we already have the description ready. The template name is 
custom rephraser and uh, <clears throat> we're going to create a custom template on this so let me just input the details as you know as you can see this is already a custom rephraser and the description is rephrase a sentence according to the premise so uh, which i've also added to the prompt on the right hand side as you can see uh, so let's create the prompt formula as uh, i'm putting in premise as premise so this is what uh, we'll be adding and uh, the next one will be the sentence or statement let's by the way, let's change it over here as well. Rather than sentence, let's put statement. So statement, again, uh, percentage statement, and again, closing it to create a new test prompt. So yeah, we have it over here, these two statements. So let me save the prompt. Yeah, it's saved. And uh, yeah, since it's saved, let's just add the premise. I've added the premise, and uh, this is the premise about uh, this uh, beautiful park. Now, I'll copy the statement as well, which is the original statement. Now, uh, as you can see on the right hand side, the, uh, the prompt is that to rephrase the statement, uh, extracting relevant information from the premise. So, uh, we already have the premise over here, and uh, below that, we have the statement which we wish to rephrase. And uh, the thing is that we do not want to change the structure of the statement. So let's ask the AI to generate a prompt. Uh, let's see. Okay, so we have it over here. Let's do it again. Uh, let's regenerate. Yeah, this this looks better. I mean, you can uh, totally generate uh, till you get the best results. Uh, but yeah, let's try once more. Let's test it again to see uh, if we can get a better result. Pretty good. Uh, yeah, once more, okay. Um, let's see what happens now. Okay, so we have the numbers. Looks pretty good. And that is all about the custom templates feature. Now, if you have any suggestions for different templates, please feel free to drop them in the comments below and we'll look into it. So that is pretty much all. Thank you so much for watching. Take care.